But once again, it's finals time here in Shawnee, Kansas. And we've got a good one as Liz Tynan and Crystal Wagner will take on Olivia Terry and Tasha Nicole. Should be uh, an exciting affair. Ah, you know, your king seat holder of uh, Olivia and Tasha have kind of been sitting for a little bit. They really do they have. they have the curse of... If they do, they have the curse of starting out slow and losing that first one. Then we go to double dip, or are they just going to come out and like we're refreshed, we're ready, and be on fire. Crystal wastes no time to put up a hat trick. Not happy with that turn, Tasha. Only manages 67. Tynan can back Wagner with a hat trick. She's already done it one. She's already done it several times today. Boy, she does it. Only manages one bull in that turn for just 80. 128, 50 50 for double 14. Well, sets well, one up. lucky on dart, too. Yeah, she does still set up Liz. I was going to say, did she did it that 17 hit that 50 left? I think her words said it all was, wow. Yeah, I can't go tops now. And hits it dead center, too. Big hit there for Tynan and Wagner. This is the ladies' combo, 501 cricket, 501. The court city goes first. Loser goes first in game two. They have to go deciding leg. It is the 501 open in, open out. Olivia Terry and Tasha Nicole have the queen seat. But right now they're down 1-0 in this first match. for the triple 19 and then goes up. Shots from Tynan. <laughs> I can hear uh, Olivia in the background. They're not too far away uh, from us. We're, we're probably about 15 feet from the throw line. So we can kind of hear the sidebar conversations going on between the players. You're 15 feet away. I'm three hours. <laughs> Crazy how we can make it work, huh? With little yeah. to no lag. It has been pretty impressive to be able to pull you on virtually. I mean, we pulled you on at, at DPFL down in Florida, and that worked out to our advantage. Now we're pulling you on here. Unfortunately, you weren't able to make it. But, uh, well, the goal was to be there in person, but unfortunately it didn't work out. With our virtual setups now, we can still make things happen. Yeah. Especially in your circumstance now, new new granddad. You need to be available to help out in certain circumstances and stuff. So, Does she go for the 20s? She does. Manages to get one. It sets it up for a one-shot close. Still got a nice 53-point lead. Cash is going to have to hit here. She doesn't even hesitate. She stays in them 20s. How 
How about this? Neil Duff bested Robert Thornton with a 92 average, 8 to 5 over there in the seniors. Isn't event. that the uh, last year's champion out? The two time defending champion of that World Seniors Champions event. Tynan and Wagner have done their work in the first leg. They're doing their work in the second leg. Terry and Nicole is going to have to get back in the matches. They they do have the queen seat. So if they lose this match, they still have the, the decider. Good heads up dart play there by Liz Tynan. Just I'll managed to get an 18. I'm going to go put some more points up for my opponent, my partner. For those that don't know, Tash is the better half currently of Mr. Dustin Holt. She, they she, travel quite a bit. They travel quite a bit. I think that she, sometimes she chooses to play, sometimes she elects not to. She's kind of one of those players that not all the time does she, does she like to participate. Maybe she just does a select number of events per weekend. If I'm not mistaken. Well, Terry and Nicole got to find something here. They don't want to go too... big uh, six mark there was huge. Yeah. They don't want to make this a 2-0 a, a and then go into the next set already. Uh, then they'll be looking, eyeballing at that two scoops put on them. We all know how that two scoops feels, too. Yeah. It's fun when you're the one double dipping. It's not fun when you get double dipped. Not at you're all. You're irritated. Not at all. Which is better sweet, winning it outright without dropping a leg or double dip in the finals? What do you think? Oh, double dip in the finals. Because <laughs> you were on your heels, you came back, you ran the gauntlet, and then you double dip the finals. Yep. Big shots there from Wagner. One step closer to the next set. Well, Wagner's putting on a little bit of a dart display. If you're not paying attention, she's scoring 4.75 for her. Like I said, that's a dangerous team. When you really think about it, you have, well, i got to think here, Tasha did not play in the Booyah Cup last year. You have four or three Booyah Cup qualifiers here from uh, the women's events last year. And I bet you they'll probably be back next year, including your, well, Olivia Terry, who, who did quite well in that uh, Booyah Cup. All right, let Didn't me go she ahead. take second to Paula? Yes, yes, I believe so. That's I was, I was, it all blends together with that second or first, but uh, yeah, good stuff. I'm going to hand this deal to them just in case they need to print off another form. And here we go. This is the deciding match. Two out of three, ladies combo. Tynan and Wagner versus Terry and Nicole. Terry and Nicole were the queen seat holders. They just lost the first match. Liz Tynan has taken the bull, and she will start match number two. So whoever just wins this two out of three takes the title, Shark Tank, and the big envelope. The big envelope and some nice trophies as well this year. I don't know if you yeah, saw those. Yeah, the shark fin. I, I I seen that. I was like, that's really nice. Yeah, they got the. Uh, it's uh, all glass, so uh, really cool trophy this year. And then of course you got your second place trophies, which uh, Terry does herself. Miss Terry Stevenson. They are uh, soup. Is it soup covers? Right. Soup koozies. So soup koozies. Yeah, okay. they're actually pretty cool. And it. Uh, I got one from the first year. Um, 
and it just basically says what you want, and uh, you put your soup bowl in it, and sit there and watch the football game, and eat your chili or whatever, and it doesn't burn your, it doesn't burn you or nothing. Pretty cool. Yeah. Still got it. Still use it. It is one of those things that you don't never think you really need until you got one, and you're like, oh, this is this is neat. <laughs> Should have got this, got this earlier. Who knows? Who knows? Maybe I'll I'll get one someday. Well, he's looking for two bulls here. Two bulls to leave a checkout opportunity. Uh, Tynan and Wagner are a little bit on a, on a little bit of a freight train right now. They haven't been stopped. No, I mean that's the that's the deadly thing about a double elimination bracket, especially the way the women's bracket went. Olivia and Tasha really have been sitting quite quite a while compared to. You know, Liz and Wagner, as they've been able to ride it out and go one after another, after another, after another to get to this point. So they're good. They're warm. It's just, you know, what, was Olivia and Tasha over on the board warming up? How long were they warming up? That's, a, that's the question. One ten, bull ten bull. Is it or that way? Oh, she went for the trip. She went for the trip twenty. That's unfortunately that's where I would go. Bull ten because you know you have that chance. Yeah. And then back to the bull because if you grab that trip ten, you'd still, you know, finish. Well, how about this? Olivia puts one on the board for her and Tasha. Finally, is what it feels like. They kind of steal it away. And was that because of the decision there from Liz? I don't know. I mean, she did have the look. She gave herself at I don't least know the if, look. What if, what, if, what if Liz went up there and went bull trip 20? Yep. And that too. That too. And she then we her, wouldn't have talked like that. <laughs> what, well, that's the thing. She gave herself two looks instead of just the one, which is, it is kind of smart. But you never know. That fat bull could have been, could have been had there. It's it's either either or. Yeah, I mean it's decision the player made when when they're in the pressure moment, when they're in the moment. Um, they live and die by those by those choices. You know, when you're sitting, you know, the armchair quarterback situation. When you're sitting in our spots, we're like, oh, you should have done this. Well, you know, what happens if we hit the trip twenty? Well, yeah, well, wouldn't have mattered. And just so you folks know. A difference in payout here. First is three hundred dollars. Second is two hundred dollars here for these ladies. So, um, a little bit of a difference there. Yeah. Not happy with that turn. First start was in, and the other two just sailed to the to the outside. Tynan will close at 19. I do see her opening another number. Big hit from Terry. She capitalizes on a seven. It's kind of cute. Yeah, and Tasha actually just came back here, and she's like, man, every time I get on stream, I I just put, put myself down. And I said, girl, you can't do that. You've been waiting here for how long to play this match? I said, you'll find your groove. Ter Terry's starting to, and then all of a sudden, boom, here we go. Tasha needs to find it here. She got to forego those thoughts. She's just got to. Just got to go up there and hit. That'll work. 
And hits big she five. does. There's a big five. Yeah, big five there for her. That could be a little confidence builder. Nikki says, uh, Liz Tynan plays split ball a lot and is quite good at triple 20. Well, we're not, we're not saying she isn't. Um, Ryan was just pointing out maybe, maybe he would, would like the bull option there instead. But, I mean, to each their own. We've said it before. To each their own. Ooh, Terry wanted that. <laughs> Terry liking it so much, she's giving us a bark. Just kidding. <laughs> Looks like Ryan's puppy may have uh, jumped up there in the background. That's quite all right. You're good, Ryan. Dash is stepping in. Opportunity to go ahead and close out the 17s and just move on to the next number. Instead, she's choosing the points option. Now you got to take a chance here. That was a good move. Get some points up there. You're playing as a team. Olivia's got the hot hand right now. Yeah. I got to keep her going. Crystal, got to find a number to work on. I would go 15s. She, I was going to say, she needs to go to the 15s. And the reason why is, yeah, she hit six there, but Tasha can still come up here and just hit one single 16, and now all that work is out the door. Right darts here. She put 18 points up, spread a little bit, got the 16 close. She went back to the 18. Now, had she had hit it, you know, it would have been even more detrimental, but she did the right darts at the right time. Ooh. Tough two darts out of Olivia. Tough three darts out of Olivia. This could be a potential. You're Wagner here. I was going to say, what do you do if here. you're Wagner here? Yeah. Yeah, what do you do if you're Wagner? Got to go 15s. Take a shot here. Oh. Does that hurt? You think Tasha will take a... Even a single 18 first dart, take a look at the 15s, or is she going she gonna to point up heavy? She's going to stay right there. No, she takes a look at the 15s. Bumped her up uh, 32 points in front of Liz, requiring the trip 15. No, she looks up. Those eyes said, bye bye, 18. So needing just the three bulls. Oh, she's going to stay on that 15. Yeah. We got to go to the third leg. That's what she's saying. We got to go to the third leg. A lot of pressure now. Liz can 
Possibly put this away. Not going to be here. Does she grabbed. She did drag the fifteen. Yeah, she she did find one, but Terry just gonna go ahead and opt to take out those fifteens, get rid of them. Mint to go to a decider. It certainly seems like it, but you never know. She had to have a double bull in that first yeah, start. Exactly. So now it will go back in the hands of Tynan, and don't see them missing too many opportunities at the bull. And there it goes. 1-1 one, one score Liz line. Is like, yeah, just Liz's face like, come on. Th I, they were right there. Yep. Now we cork, and it's open in, open out, 501. <laughs> Looks like Olivia <laughs> Terry grabbed that one. Here should be some some knuckles, some high fives, some hugs, maybe. Oh, she wanted that low ton turn. Unlucky on that third dart. Tynan and Wagner prove that they're hat trick capable. Did I give her the commentator's curse? You could have. I believe this is for all the marbles. What do you think? It definitely is. There's some pressure added here. There's no denying that. Especially when it comes to that last leg decider. They see a little nerves, maybe some sporadic darts. Well, three six six, three six eight. Got to get to zero. Single in, single out, full bull. Who's got it? Who can do it? Big dart. She needed another there. Needed that one extra bull. Doesn't convert, so one point advantage to Terry and Nicole. She needs another one. She gets it. Nicole does her part. She leaves Terry on and out. Wagner's turn. They can't get any more neck and neck than this. Game. You know what I'm saying? Uh, exactly. I mean, look at this 138, 144 now. Does this happen? I'm not to saying go? much because I'm watching it. It's back and forth, back and forth. Get another one. Oh, another one would have been handy for her to leave the 32. 
Instead, Tynan for the 1-4-4. Pull 54. Oh, boy. Liz Tynan. Oh, my goodness, Ryan. That's when you wish you had a little bit of luck on your side. Oh, my gosh. How did that not go? Got to go to 15s here. Trip 15 leaves you a double. Single 15 leaves you trip 20. You got to go 15s here. Yep, and I think she's kind of hesitant as she looks behind her, and Terry says, trip 15, trip 15. Oh, big shots. For the win. Even the double. You can see there's definitely some interest. There's a few ladies watching this one. And you can just do that. Two 20s, and she pulls it off. Well, congratulations to Liz Tynan and Crystal Wagner winning the women's doubles combo. Uh, they got knocked out in the semis and then worked their way back through the bracket to make it to the finals and then uh, double dip in the finals with a 2-1 score difference in the final match.